the police have radar and lasers. I'm stopping you because the speed limit's 25 miles an hour, sir. They have automatic cameras, all the high-tech advantages. And some drivers ask, is this fair? I think it's a rip-off. I also think that they're just collecting money from people. One man in San Diego is fighting a system he says is stacked against drivers. He likes to point out the automatic teller machine in front of his local traffic court. Right now, the system is set up to intimidate you into paying, and not even to make you aware of your legal rights. Many of the notices the court sends you don't even tell you that you have the right to contest. Patrick Mulroy um, calls himself the ticket assassin. He operates an internet website that advises how to fight tickets. Look up the law, he says. The officer might have it wrong. Go to court. The officer might not show. And guilty or not, your chances of a reduced fine or no fine increase if you just say you're not guilty. The best way is just to vigorously contest every ticket that you get. Jonathan Montag, a lawyer who knew nothing about traffic law, took that advice after he was caught by an automatic red light camera. And right here before the freeway, all of a sudden, all the lights started flashing. And just I like that. And <laughs> just like that, exactly. That's him in the picture and his car in the intersection. But the citation says the light was red only two tenths of a second. He paid the $271 fine but fought the ticket in court. His case was dismissed because the state was not ready to prosecute. If you fight it, you have a chance of getting your money back, and I did. I've never had a ticket in my life. Patrick Mulroy's goal is to clog the courts with people fighting tickets. And there's no way the traffic courts could handle 600,000 cases a year. Of course, he hopes to make a little money, too. But it's an honor system. Ten dollars for his advice if you lose, twenty if you win. The matter is dismissed. You are free to go. Brian Looney, ABC News, San Diego.